My name is Christian Vogler. I'm part of the SAP S4HANA Product Success, Co-Innovation and Content Team. In the next couple of minutes, I would like to give you an overview of what we are going to deliver in this 2108 release of SAP S4HANA Cloud for product compliance. I will start with the Compliance Data Foundation and in the last video for the 2105 release, I talk about the management of regulatory graphics. Now with the 2108 release, we introduce the new labeling section for labels and markings for packages. You can now select labels and markings for packages, and you can select placards and markings for containers, tanks, and vehicles. Just to give you a short background here, labeling, marking, and placarding are important steps when preparing a dangerous good for transportation. This allows to visualize hazards associated with the dangerous goods and communicate information about safe handling. The second topic here is that we bring more intelligence in the process to support you in your dangerous goods classification process. You can use the new Determine Labels feature. With this feature, the system determines applicable labels using specific predefined rules and automatically files the labeling section with the determined labels. And of course, you can adapt the determined labels if needed. One remark, here you use uh, the graphics that are delivered with the SAP content and are managed in the Managed Regulatory Graphics, SAP Fiori App. Now, let's move to the second key innovations, and here I like to talk about Substance Volume Tracking. With the 2108 release, we introduce the monitoring of volumes of substances that are exported to a country or exported to a region. With this feature, you can get an overview of the aggregated volumes of substances that are exported to a country or to a region by a legal entity in your company. Here also, I like to give you a short background. In many countries, regulations stipulate that above a certain quantity of chemicals and other hazardous substances, you must register with the authority the maximum quantity of these substances that you plan to purchase, import, produce, sell, or export in a certain period. Substance volume tracking helps you to comply with the relevant regulations by recording the quantities of substances needed to be tracked. And by comparing the recorded quantity with a limit value, the system can alert you in good time before a limit value is exceeded. And finally, my last key innovation is in the safety data sheet management. And here you are now able to specify legal area for product compliance. Legal areas are used in product compliance to define, for example, legal compositions, legal deviation for material-based compositions, or to specify how to use the product. For each legal area, you can now assign the country or region in which the legal area is relevant. Now I am at the end of this uh, release video, and I would like to invite you to join the new SAP S4HANA cloud community to learn more about our innovations. For more input, also stay tuned and check out my 2108 release blog on blogs.sap.com. Thanks for tuning in, stay safe, stay healthy, and hope to see you next time.